Hey guys, it's Creaky C, and today we're going to be taking a look at my new desk setup. Now, I made a video on my setup a long time ago, but since then I got a new desk, and then that desk broke, so I got a new one, and I'm actually getting a new chair as well. It's on its way. I don't know when it'll be here, though. And also, I'd like to say sorry for not uploading forever. I have been super busy, and I haven't had, like, a... a convenient camera to use or had stuff to film. I hope to get more siren tests because a new siren was just installed next to my school and uh, I should be uploading more during the summer. Uh, but right now this is my desk. It's pretty clean. Um, I just built I just built my new desk and I fixed all my cable management stuff. So on the top here we have a Dell 1680x1050 monitor and an AOC 1920x1080 monitor. I have a nice little bendy lamp that kind of does stuff. It's convenient for when I need to like move it if I want to do homework or use my keyboard. And then I have my 3D benchies and this little laser engraved thing <laughs> that I did. I have my Mac OS 10.5 installer box and just some pencils behind it. My keyboard is just an Apple A1048 uh, membrane keyboard. It feels like garbage, but it gets the job done. And then I just have a cheap Amazon gaming mouse. It's kind of a boring mouse, but it has RGB, and that's, <laughs> that's something. My computer down here is a Mac Pro 1.1 1 from 2006. Now, I know this computer is very, very old, but I installed Mac OS X El Capitan on it when I got it, and it runs pretty decently. It ha or, Let me open it up. So I can show you the inside. So inside, under this little cover here, we have two Intel Xeon dual-core processors for four total cores at 2.66 gigahertz. We have two RAM cards with four DIMMs on each. On the bottom card, we have four gigs, and on the top, we have 16 for 20 gigabytes total of RAM. My GPU is just an AMD HD5770 one gigabyte card. It is not Mac flashed, so I don't get a boot logo, which kind of sucks, but I could flash it later on if I wanted to. And then up here, we have two optical drive bays, which is only just occupied by one optical drive, because I don't need to. We have a decent power supply up here, and we have lots of fans, which do get noisy at times, but that's okay, because keeping my computer cool is important. Now on the back, I definitely did a lot of cable managing. Now, I would have used black zip ties, but I don't have any, so white zip ties will only work right now. And then cables just kind of run, be run behind the desk as well. And then I just have a little thing, um, a power strip thing. And then the, the cover just easily goes right on. And then you go in the back here and press this lever down and it locks on. Now, I do want to point out that this Mac Pro was dropped in shipping, and I'm really sad about that. But it doesn't really affect performance. So, we're going to go ahead and power this on right now. There's the chime. Now, I do like to point out again that there's no boot logo on the screen because it's not a flashed card so it has no drivers until the OS can load the web drivers which kind of stinks but that's okay. So we're gonna wait until the computer comes on. Alright and my computer came on so I actually pulled up my specs. Now I have my serial number covered up because reasons. So it's running Mac OS X El Capitan version 10.11.6, it has two 2.66 GHz dual-core Intel Xeons, 20 GB of DDR2 FBDIM RAM, and an ATI Radeon HD 5000 1 GB. It's actually 5770, but again, because it is not a Mac Flash card, it does not really know what it is, and it can't work correctly until the computer fully boots up. Now I'm going to open this back up with it running so you can get a good idea of what it sounds like.
It's a very beautiful computer. And I definitely, if you want to get a cheap budget Mac, I definitely recommend trying to find one of these on eBay. Er, now, I would re I'd try to find a, at least a Mac Pro 3, comma 1, not a 1, comma 1, because the Mac's OS these can run is Mac OS 10 El Capi 10. And that that operating system is already three, four years old, so it's still supported technically, but it it won't be for long. So yeah, here's my computer and my whole desk setup. Now thank you guys so much for watching. I am really sorry for not uploading anything recently, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos from me. And uh, leave a comment for any ideas or recommendations you want to see, or any video ideas you want to see on my channel in the upcoming um, future. So, because I love to hear from you guys, and just let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll definitely consider your ideas. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.